Hi. On this training session for the VPAL CX350 and CX380 cable TV expert test sets, we will show you how to perform software upgrades and how to update the test profiles on your meter. You should register your test set at our website to gain access to extra information, test procedures, and software updates. This session covers the following topics. How to obtain a copy of the new software. How to unzip and copy the software image to a USB flash drive. How to initiate the upgrade process in the test set. How to connect to the R server. And, finally, how to get the test profiles from the R server. It is assumed that you are already familiar with your meter. You may get the new software package in different ways. Registered users can log on to our website and download the latest software version available. If supported, you can also get software updates from the R server. You may have received an email with a link from our customer care team, your supervisor, or a coworker. Or, you may have received a USB flash drive from your supervisor. If you received an email message with a link, just open the message, click on the link, and save the zip file to the desktop. Registered user can visit our website and log on to our customer portal. Select Software on the left side of the web page. Click on the chassis pull-down menu. Select CX350 or CX380, depending on your meter. Based on your selection, a list of available content is shown. Identify the line item containing the software image. It is identified by a compressed file icon. Click on the link to start the download process. Select Save or Save As option. The pop-up message may look different depending on the type of web browser being used. Save the zip file to the desktop. Once the download process is finished, right-click on the zip file and select Extract All. The resulting image file will have a .tar.gz file extension. Insert the USB memory to the PC. Make sure it is a common FAT32 drive. Copy the image file to the root of the USB memory. Remove the USB memory stick from the PC. Make sure the meter is connected to the AC charger. Identify the USB port on the left side of the test set. Open the protective cover. Make sure the test set is powered off. Insert the USB memory stick. Press the lock, file, and power buttons simultaneously until you hear a beep. Then, release the buttons. The software upgrade process starts. The upgrade process will take a few minutes. You may leave the meter unattended during the upgrade process, as it is fully automated. The test set will restart itself when the software upgrade process is complete. It will go back to the main menu. Now that your meter is running the latest software version, it is time to update its test profiles. For this, you will need to connect to the R server. First, establish an IP connection using your choice of built-in cable modem, Ethernet port, or Wi-Fi. Then, go back to the main menu. If you are using the built-in cable modem, make sure the modem icon is green. Press the R server button. On the register tab, tap on the server address field. Use the keypad to enter its IP address. Press Apply when ready. Press the Check button. 
you will see a red banner at the bottom of the screen, indicating that some files need to be downloaded. Go to the Download tab. Note that several items are marked as New. Press the Download button, which will automatically download all required items. Wait for the downloads to be completed, then press OK. The test set will restart automatically to apply the new profiles. Your CX meter is now ready for use. You should regularly enter the R server page and press check to check for any profile or software updates. For example, after any meter software upgrade, you will need to access the R server to download the latest profiles. This concludes our short software upgrade training for the CX350 and CX380. We hope you find this information helpful. Thank you for choosing VX.